Welcome to Pawpaw Ridge. Today we'll be inoculating some logs with lion's mane spores. One of the first things you need to do is cut keyways into the logs and then you separate each section of the log to about one foot pieces. cut the logs in this certain totem pole style for lion's mane but you have to drill them differently you don't drill them on the side you have to drill them on the inside then they stack so let's get to the drilling you can get a special drill bit from a company called North Spore it helps control the correct diameter and depth of the drilled hole for the wooden plug So these are the plugs we're going to use with the lion's mane spores on them. Um, next thing we do is drive them into the holes. You want to stop as much moisture loss as you can so for the totem style you have to you don't seal the inside but you have to seal the bottom and tops with wax food safe wax Okay, so now what we do is we end up stacking all of them and align all the different cuts. And now we have to seal this with some saran wrap. So now we've finished all the parts, um, so now we stack them like this. This is the traditional style or called the log cabin style, and this is the totem style. This is what's supposed to work best for the lion's mane, but we'll see because both these are inoculated with lion's mane. And um, let me show you what it should look like in eight, to, eight months to a year. So these shiitake logs are older logs. They're probably three to five years old. But you can see, hopefully, the lion's mane will look like this pretty soon. You notice all the different shiitakes we have right now. Mm -hmm. 